In this video, I'm going to show you the very first thing you should install on your C8 Corvette. For all the details, stick around. So one of the items I consider a design flaw in the C8 Corvette has to do with these front radiators. And you notice, of course, there's one here on the driver's side. And as I come around, you'll see there's one also on the passenger side. And the difficulty here is that this honeycomb they have created is so large that it allows stones, and here's an example, there would be no problem with that stone flying right through that opening and then damaging your radiator. And so what has happened is aftermarket companies, and in this case, Scrape Guard is the one that we selected, uh, makes a honeycomb mesh that's a much smaller opening that uh, is actually installed behind this original plastic uh, grill. And that protects the radiator from being damaged by stones getting kicked up on the road. And so this is kind of the before picture to show you what it looks like. Now I'm gonna insert a little video right here from a 2021 convertible that I drove. And uh, you can see the damage to their radiator because uh, it had uh, several thousand miles on it and did not have any protection. And so this is the before picture. And now we're gonna take it to George Maddox Chevrolet in Redford Township, Michigan tomorrow. And they are going to install the scrape guard radiator guards, uh, scrape armor, pardon me, radiator guards. And then we'll show you what, the, um, what it looks like when it's done. So my kit from Scrape Armor with the radiator guards arrived yesterday. So let's open up the box and see what we got inside. So this top layer, and I'll just pull it out. This is um, your installation instructions. This is your uh, toolkit. And then you can see it's got a variety of metal brackets that are used for affixing it to your C8 Corvette. Let me set that aside. Here's what they look like. And it's basically just a lightweight piece of uh, aluminum. It's got a honeycomb mesh to it. So, and then the second one should be underneath here. There it is. And then, of course, there's your uh, hardware pack with uh, whatever additional items you need for installation. And so that gives you an idea what comes in the package from Scrape Armor. And so here is what the finished product looks like, as you can see. It's been installed and it's been affixed on the back so it, uh, it won't move too much. The holes obviously are small enough to deflect most of the stones that would come its direction. If you're curious, uh, my dealer charged $200 to install that. But looking online at some of the others that uh, people install, it looks like a relatively straightforward process. I think a lot of people will probably do this project themselves. It involves um, getting underneath and, and disconnecting and pulling a panel out under here so that you can reach up behind it and fix the screws on the back here. And, um, and so I'm sure a lot of uh, do-it-yourselfers will install those themselves. But GM will tell you that the damage to the radiators is only cosmetic. But it's interesting to note that Scrape Armor is an official Chevrolet partner and that the radiator guards they sell for the C8 generation Corvette are an official Chevy accessory. Now, there are other companies making radiator guards for C8s, but I believe Scrape Armor is the only one that's officially recognized by Chevrolet. I would also suggest you order them before your car arrives, as at the time in June of 2022 when our 2023 Corvette arrived, Scrape Armor was out of stock and we had to put in an order directly through their website in order to try and get them. Now, our dealership, Maddox Chevrolet, also tries to stock that product, but they also had a number of them on back order at the time. Now, if you're someone who's worried about the airflow to the radiators when you track your car, I wouldn't concern yourself with it. The Ron Fellows Performance Driving School at Spring Mountain in Las Vegas uses them on all their C8 track cars. Now, I figure if it's good enough for them, it's good enough for the rest of us. My name is Tom Straup. You've been watching Find the Right Road. If you enjoyed this video, please click the like button and consider subscribing to my channel. Thanks, and we'll catch you next time.